Hi everyone and uh, welcome back to a brand new video on my channel. As you can see today I'm back with a brand new video on Rocket League and today I'm back with a brand new random car challenge. It's that time of the season again, you know, where I sort of come into the end so I thought I'd do a random car challenge. This was I think the last one I had at the end of the last episode. So yeah, let's see what randomised car I get. Okay, so this is our first randomised car. Got the Harbinger GXT in line. That don't actually look like a bad car to be honest. I feel like the design isn't too bad. I wonder what the um, orange car looks like. The orange one, I feel like the orange one doesn't quite work as well. But yeah, to be honest, the orange one kind of fits with the wheels. But it's the hat I think works better with this one. Then we got the Affluenta in sky blue. Got the Maxi PA wheels in orange. I mean, they're alright. They're not the best. There's a lot better wheels out there. Got Forest Green, Radiant Gush, no, Rad Rock. I mean, that works with the lime of the car. It's almost that hat doesn't actually look too bad, I'm going to be honest. Then, don't know what th flag that is. Equatorial Guinea. And then you've got Rad Rock in Crimson, kind of fitting with the boost. And Smoke Sketch. I mean, that's alright. Don't really like the colour, but yeah. So, yeah, let's get into the first game. Okay, so in my first game, got the orange one. I like the orange one. Just so many different colours on the car just does not work, like, at all. So, yeah, I think... Generally, because at the moment, like when I'm viewing it from behind, all I can really see is the lime from the car and obviously the green boost. So that kind of works. But as soon as I go side on, it just doesn't work because all of the weird blues, orange, greens, like colours that don't really work together at all. You just only really see them. I'm surprised he didn't hit that. And my game's sort of lagging a little bit again. I seem to get that quite a lot, like a little bit of screen lag. Oh, nice. That was a nice little sort of like um, follow up just to make sure it didn't go in. So if I didn't do that, it would have gone in. I don't know if he, mean, if he meant to fake that, but that was kind of nice, I'm going to be honest. That hit from the other guy was not very good. Yeah, that was a really nice fake. I don't know if he meant to do it or not. Because, I mean, it looked like he kind of missed it. Didn't really look like what you would do if it was a fake. Not really where I wanted that to go. I'll wait for him to touch it. And then guess he doesn't. But I feel like that guy is very easily, like, he misses it a fair bit. Because that's the second time he's done that now. I'll just control it. Ooh, I was hoping to try and get it on goal. Let's just try and hit it down. I mean, normally I feel like I wouldn't go for that, but as I know my teammate isn't really done. Apart from in that situation. Then, yeah, I kind of went for it. That one, I, I want to know what he was thinking. Like, why was he still there? Could he not see me coming into it? I, I certainly couldn't see him from where I was. So, yeah, very annoying. Decent shot. I'll try and get it on the... Yeah, too high. It's kind of awkward because I didn't want to go up too high because then I feel like it would have barely touched it. But then at the same time, like, it's kind of hard to get a decent shot from that. Okay. Oh... I didn't quite turn enough. I feel like I should have put on um, my, what's it called? I can't remember the name of it, but it's sort of like a slide to turn quicker. Like a drift sort of thing. I can't remember what it's called, power slide. But yeah, I should have used that. That kind of worked the way I wanted. I wanted to kind of 50 into the middle. Not going to go for that. They're both on it. Decent 50, don't know where my teammate is. He's way behind. He'll have that. A 
Yeah, again, same thing. It's like one of those awkward things. A double jump is sort of too high, but then a single jump sort of isn't high enough. I mean, I had that. If he shot it, I would have had it. Just bang that. Hopefully he does a nice hit for me. Not really what I wanted. Hopefully my teammate can get something decent. Ooh, that was an alright shot actually. It was sort of like it was sort of like awkward for him from where I was. Like he bumped his teammate and then I just put it very awkward. Like it wasn't going slow, so he had to kind of go quick. But then at the same time, it's very easy from that position to sort of go too fast. Mm, that's unfortunate, but I mean, my teammate was back, so it's fine. Just control that. Get that up, and then bang it. Should have tried to put that more middle, maybe. But to be honest, I was trying to shoot it. Ooh, I didn't think that was in. That's surprising actually, because I wasn't trying to get it in, I was just trying to sort of put it in the middle. Let's hit that across. Don't know where my teammate was, because he just came flying. It's surprising how many people do that, literally just sit behind you and just wait. Like sitting behind someone is just so dumb. Very nice shot. Yeah, I mean, I probably should have read that better. See what happens. Just sort of sit here and wait. I'll have that. Yeah, unfortunately, I, I was surprised I didn't kind of get that slightly from where the from the way he hit it. Don't know where my teammate is. He's right there. I like that one because you'll have so little momentum built up. You probably should have like rotated back into the middle, and I could have came in sort of like more full power. I don't know where anyone is. Again, a similar sort of thing that he came in like very full power. I mean, maybe I could have rotated out, but it was sort of one of those awkward places. And obviously I wanted I wanted to try and 50 it, so maybe my teammate would have a better thing on it. Yeah, that's very... I can't really do anything from that position, because I couldn't really see where the other guy was, because I was sort of coming into it. And at that point, by the time I've turned around, it's just too late. Hopefully, yeah, my kickoff kind of sucked there. My kickoffs this game have been alright, but not the best. And I missed the boost, both boosts, so... Yeah, unfortunate. I mean, that was a fairly close game. But yeah, see what my next randomised car is. Okay, so this is my next randomised car. Kind of looks a bit weird. What does the orange one look like? The orange one doesn't look too bad. The purple doesn't really fit, though. But yeah, got the zippy. Got the... I don't know how to say that. The spatio temporal. I think that's how you say it. That's not a bad um, decal. That actually looks really nice. I'm going to be honest. I quite like that. Especially that colouring. I like that one. That that still looks decent. But that colouring is really nice. Then you got the 3 lobe, Which is very basic. You've got the Season 2 Diamond. Which does not fit the colours at all. Got the Hard Hat. Which again it just looks clunky on top. It literally looks like it's floating as well. Like just floating on top. Then you've got the Sidemen FC. And then you've got the Saffron Overgrowth. That, that's not actually a bad gold explosion to be honest. And the Hacks were free. That very much suits the decal colour. Looks very much like it as well. So yeah, let's get into the next game. Okay, so I've joined this one mid-game. And that, I don't know what he was doing there. And another thing that's quite surprising, he sort of came from behind as well. Like his teammate probably would have had a better chance on that than he did. Yeah, I was very, very awkward in that position. 
I mean, my teammate, I think he demoed and missed the ball. Don't know if it was intentional or not, but then I'm kind of screwed because I can't get to it in time. And, yeah, I can't really do anything. Oh, I did miss the goal. Nice and easy for my teammate. That is actually quite a nice goal decision in the white. I didn't actually know where my teammate was, so I thought I'd just try and shoot it. And to be honest, it made it an easier shot for him as well. Wasn't as fast. And was basically an open net. They'll probably go for that. Or not. I hate it when they do that, when they like they're so close you think, oh he's probably gonna go for that and then they just leave it. Like I think you're going for it, so I've left it and now you're not going for it. See what he does. Oh my god. With the zero boost I had, I somehow managed to hit that. Let's just see what this guy does. Again, why is he challenging that from behind? Like, so many people do that and it's just so dumb. The only reason I did that is because they could shoot and I was just trying to hit it up and out the way. So, sort of, I feel like that's the only time that I feel like it's sort of appropriate is when, you know, you're sort of like stopping them from getting a shot on. Oh, I was unfortunate, didn't know where he was. Or something like that maybe. If you can see your teammates not going for it, but I don't suppose he probably saw me. Let's just wait to see what touch he gets. Nice, I'll follow. Bang that into the middle. Teammate should be there. Nice. Honestly, I was kind of concerned that he might go for it at that point. Where, you know, he can't really do that much on it. Whereas letting me go for it meant I could sort of bang it into the middle. You know, he's got an easy shot. Let's just wait to see what this guy does. Not bad. Oh, I was slightly too far off of the wall. I don't really where I could judge that. That guy just thought, nah, I've had enough of this. Just gave up. You just see it, like, straight away. Right there. He's just like, nah, I'm not even going to try. I can't be bothered. Like, he just gave up. So what's the zippy car? I don't actually mind it. I don't know what hitbox it's got, but I'm not actually getting on too bad with it. Like, it kind of looks alright as well, like the decal carries it a lot, but it still looks real nice. Oh, not in, but it's basically an open net for my teammate. Have I actually scored any goals yet in this game? No, I've literally assisted all of his goals. Oh dear, I'm just, I keep getting that sometimes, like all I can hit is the, is the side of the goal. Like, and it is working, because it's setting up all the plays, but... It's really annoying for me because it means that I can't get any goals. See what my teammate does. Hopefully he doesn't challenge that because I feel like that that's like a far post rotation type thing he should be doing. Oh, not really what I was hoping for, but oh well. I think I might have starved that guy a boost as well. Good, good, good. Terrible touch, but I mean it worked, so... Ooh. That is very awkward. So now he's sort of in a decent upward position. And my teammate completely missed it, so... Yeah. Oh! Lovely little air dribble to ground pinch. It wasn't the cleanest air dribble, to be honest. I was just trying to get it into the middle, but then that little, like, sort of almost close to a ground pinch, he just was not expecting it, and it worked so well. And that actually happens to be my first goal of the game. So, going from hitting the post and everything to getting it right in the middle of the goal. Fairly nice play. That's probably one of the best shots I've actually made on a video, because I don't really normally get decent shots while recording. I can't believe he let that happen. 
cannot believe it. Sort of off of the corner. I was hoping I might be able to maybe get like a half flip shot, but didn't really work out that well. Oh, hopefully my teammate can get to it. Yeah, I mean, it's one of those where it's like an awkward thing because I'm trying to get it so he can't get to it. And at the same time, like my teammate's already there. So it's like kind of awkward. I mean, hey, it don't really matter. We're 5 2 up. He can hit that if he wants, I don't care. Teammate should have that. I don't know where he is. Horrible position, but got it at least, so not too bad. Oh. Again, he literally did the same thing there, where it's like he makes it look like he's going for it. Like, don't make it look like you're going for it and then not go for it. Like, if you're gonna commit, commit. Like, seriously? Like that. I made it, I committed, but I actually hit it, so, you know? But, yeah, I mean, I was fairly happy with that game. I played incredible. I got so many passes, like, I swear, I think three of his four goals were generally because of my pass, because I gave him, like, an open net or something. So, you know, fairly nice. And then my goal, yeah, that was real nice. Like, you could visibly see his ankles break in as I did that on him. He could not see that come in at all. But yeah, I was, I'm was i very happy with that game. And to be honest, the car design was kind of sick as well. I, I kind of liked it. So, hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, leave a like, subscribe, let me know anything else you'd like to see on Rocket League or any other games you'd like to see on this channel. And yeah, I'll see you guys all in the next one. Built an empire.